Grandma, what is that above my head? Those are all your childhood memories, dear, and it looks like you've already made quite a lot of them. Well, that's good, because I want to remember all the fun things I did with you. Oh, Annalise, you are so sweet. There is a fire in the castle. We need to get you both out now. Grandma, I'm scared. I don't want to lose you like I lost my parents. Don't worry, dear. We'll be all right. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsing! No! You left your clothes on the floor. Sorry, I just... They pay me to foster you, not to be your maid. Didn't anyone ever teach you to clean up after yourself? Well, you know, even if someone did, I really wouldn't have remembered because I lost all my childhood memories. Yeah, yeah, enough with your sob story. Just clean up. Excuse me, sir. Do you know why there's a bunch of flowers everywhere? Oh, yeah, those are for the princess. Everyone leaves those for her. Today marks the fifth year of her passing. It's awful what happened to her. Hey, are you okay? I think I just had a memory of me being a princess. Sorry, I know that sounds crazy. A princess? Wait, did something happen to your memory? Yeah, actually, when I was younger, some sort of accident happened to me. I don't remember what, but the doctor told me that I have amnesia. Some people still think the princess is still alive. They do? Yeah, and actually, I'm one of those people. You know, I could take you to the queen if you really think you're the princess. No, that's okay. Uh, I really should be going. At least take my number. If any more of your memories come back, call me. I can't believe that guy thought that I was a princess. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsed! No! Grandma? She left me. Uh, my head... Hey, I got your voicemail. You got another memory? I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. The thing is, they won't just let anyone into the castle. We have to convince them that you're royalty. But how would I do that? I have an idea. Come on, we're going shopping. Are you sure this outfit isn't too much? No, I think it's perfect. It shows the queen that you know how to dress like a princess. If you say so. Wait here. The queen will see you in just a moment. Hey, it's gonna be alright. She'll remember you. Grandma, I thought I never- See me again. I've heard it all before. Tell me something that only my Annalise would know. Well, I can't exactly do that because a lot of my memories got lost, but I remember you. Stop. My heart can't take this anymore. She's just another girl pretending to be my granddaughter. Take her away. No, please. I came all this way to see you. I'm sure I can remember something. Let's go. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. Let her go. I need to get something to show her. This was one of the few things that survived the fire. I had it restored. I bought it as a gift for my granddaughter. You couldn't have known about that unless... It's me, Grandma. Oh, Annalise, it is you. I recognize your eyes. I'm so sorry. I begged the gods to go look for you. It's okay. How are you alive? What happened? I can barely remember. Sweetheart, can you remember anything about what happened to you? What your name is? What your parents' names are? I don't remember anything. We have a code red. So you survived the fire and woke up in a hospital with amnesia. I am so sorry, but what's important is we're together now. Grandma, I actually wouldn't have been able to find you if it wasn't for him. Oh, really? What is your name? My name is Eric, Your Majesty. I can't thank you enough, Eric. Why aren't you a handsome young man? Ah, uh, thanks. It is my honor to restore my granddaughter's title of Princess Annalise. Long live the princess. Time to see how much money my boyfriend has in his bank account. Not that that's important. I knew he had money, but not that much money. I'm going to pay him a little visit. Hey. Hey, handsome. I shouldn't tell him I know what's in his bank account. So, baby, what do you want for Christmas? Well, there is this Gucci bag that I really like, but you know what? What am I saying? You don't have to get me anything. Come on. Of course I'm getting you something. In fact, you might get that Gucci bag as long as you're not too naughty. I'll try. Right now, why don't you go out and buy yourself whatever you need? Okay. Bad news. What? Fluffy's sick. The vet says she needs surgery. <clears throat> well, how much is it? It's about $2,000. We can't afford it. You know what? I think I got it covered. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, good. Babe, I'm- Whoa. Back. Listen, it's not what it looks like. We can't break up. I need his money. 
I can't break up with him. I need his money. Uh, her and I are just friends. Yeah, I'm gonna go now. Bye. Babe, I made a mistake. I'm sorry. It's okay. We all make mistakes. And it was my bad, really. I should have knocked before coming in. Thanks for understanding. She kind of made a mess. Do you think you can clean up? I gotta go to work. Of course, honey. All clean, and you just go make the money. Thanks, babe. Love you. Bye. He is so dead. I'm so happy Fluffy's okay, but how did you get the money to pay for her surgery? Mom, about that. There's something that I need to tell you. I can't believe he cheated on you. I know, but now that Fluffy's okay, I think I'm gonna go break up with him. What? Looks like he just got another paycheck. And you still have his credit card. Don't break up just yet. I have a plan for how you can get revenge. Hey, sweetie. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Who is she? You know, I was about to ask you the same thing, but you look really familiar. Are you a model or something? Uh, actually, yes. Figures. I'm sorry, babe, but this girl was just leaving. But you said... No, stay. I think you're going to want to see this. I actually got him a little something. Here you go, sweetheart. Thanks. Oh, wait, but first, before you open that, I believe this is mine, right? Uh-huh. That's your Gucci bag. That's the one you wanted, right? Yes, it is. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and open yours. All right. What's this? Receipts of things that I bought this week. Baby, 10K worth of stuff? Oh, baby, you and I both know that you can afford it. Oh, and there's a card in there, too. Go ahead and read that. Roses are red, violets are blue, you're a dirty, rotten cheater, I'm breaking up with you? Merry Christmas. <laughs> Girl, let's get out of here. I'm right behind you. Wait. Ladies, I'll buy you anything. No amount of money is worth being with him. Goodbye. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or... Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996? You used an extra word, and you're going to tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're going to tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed, now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because, after I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> My phone is dead, and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> So step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Babe, I got... Don't you dare use any more of those words. Understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm... What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you going to go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be six ninety nine back on the card. Please help me. Well, I'm allergic to cats, so guess I'll have to have a twin of myself. Hi. Hi, can I come in? Yeah, come on in. My mom wants me to go do the dishes. I'll be right back, okay? No, no, I can do them for you. For real? Totally, your mom will just think I'm you. Just stay here and I'll be right back. Okay, well, thanks. Maybe having a twin isn't so bad. Bye, babe, talk to you later. Was that your boyfriend? Yeah. Can I see a picture of him? Uh, yeah, sure. Here, this is him. Aw, he's so cute. I know, right? Damn it. 
What's wrong? I just realized I have a history test today. I didn't even study. Oh, I could take it for you. I'm great at history. Wait, you are? Yeah, I totally got this. I'm just like you, you know, but I'm just a little bit smarter. How'd it go? Well, I got you a 100%. No way. Yep, but I gotta go. I'm gonna go meet your friend Amy and we're gonna go get her nails done. Wait, what? Is something wrong? Well, it's just Amy's my best friend. Oh, I know, but she thinks that I'm you. And I just thought since I took your test, I could have some time to relax. But if you don't want me to go, no, go ahead. You deserve a break. Hey, sorry I took so long. We went out to dinner after. You did? Yeah, Amy is such a sweetheart. Yeah, she really is. Oh, where are you off to dress all fancy like that? I am going on a little date with Ian. You sure you don't need me to take your place? No, that's okay. I'm just kidding with you. Go have fun. Hey girl, how'd it go? It was so nice. He... Why are you looking at my laptop? Oh, I was just looking at some pictures of you and your boyfriend, and I was reading through your diary. I did not know you struggled with anxiety. Hey, that's private. I just thought since I'm your twin, I should know more about you. Get out of my room. After all I did for her, and she's going to yell at me like that? I don't think so. I just want to say I'm sorry for looking at your laptop. I shouldn't have done that. Don't even worry about it. I shouldn't have got so upset at you either. It's totally fine. I forgive you. Are you going on another date? Yeah, Ian's gonna take me to go see a movie. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I love that for you guys. Hey, um, I grabbed this out of the fridge. I didn't really like it. Do you want it? Actually, this one's my favorite, so thanks. You ready to go? <sighs> Whoa. Oh, what's wrong? I don't know, my head just feels really weird. Oh, honey, you need to lay down. <sighs> That's it. Just relax. Hey, can you hear me? Hello? Perfect. I'm doing your boyfriend a favor. He's gonna have so much more fun with me than he would have with you. <sighs> she stole my phone and she locked all the doors. I knew I should have gotten that cat. Hey there, sleepyhead. Did you enjoy your little nap? Where's Ian? Oh, he just left. We had an amazing time. He even said that I'm a great kisser. You kissed him? Well, more like he kissed me, but... <laughs> you really should have done that. Give me back my phone. No, I don't think I will. Remember when I told you that I was smarter than you? Well, guess what? I'm also stronger than you, too. So which dress do you think Ian will like better? This one? Or, hold on, <laughs> do you think he'll like this one better? I think you're right. I think he's gonna like the first one better. Well, thanks for the help, but um, you probably won't last too much longer in here. I found out in your diary that you're hypoglycemic. Bye, Mom. I'm going to class. Wait, let me see your neck. Why didn't you put on the makeup? I ran out. Oh, great. Well, looks like you're not going to school. What? Come on, it's so small. I can cover it with my hair and no one's even gonna notice. I said no! You know what will happen if people see that mark, they'll start to ask questions. And all get taken away. I know. I'll buy you makeup when I get back. I love you. I love you more. I love you most. See you after work. I had a big test today, and I'm not supposed to miss it. No one's gonna notice this. I'll just take the test and come right back. Great job on your test today. Thanks. Hey, what's that on your neck? <gasps> I've seen that mark before. Let me see. Yes, that mark, it means you're royalty. What? You must be the lost princess. Legend says you have powers. Powers? What? No, I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to trick me so you can take me away. Well, that's not gonna Wait. happen. I'm home. What's wrong? Something happened. Who else saw the mark? Just that teacher, but she said something about me being a lost princess. <laughs> you, a princess, please. Just look at your chubby little face. You look nothing like royalty. You must never go outside again. Never? Yes, you've been exposed. It's much too dangerous now. Don't be so sad, dear. I know. I'll go get you some food. You just relax. Watch some TV. This just in, a teenage boy is on the run from the cops today after allegedly stealing a crown from the royal family. Mom? Mom? Jeez, who designed these locks? <gasps> that is definitely not Mom. He's probably here for my mark. Good thing I have some more makeup. 
Whoa, wasn't expecting anyone to be home, but hey. Stay back. I'm warning you. I'm highly trained in the art of origami. Isn't that paper folding? I was kind of hoping you wouldn't know what that was. Relax, dollface. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to stash something. So, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> I just knocked him out. I just knocked him out. I wonder what he was trying to stash. A crown. This must be from the royal family. <gasps> Mom's home. I gotta hide him. Riley, I'm tired. Please give me a hand massage. I will, but after. Right now I wanted to tell you that you don't have to worry about me going outside anymore. I told you it's too dangerous. No, Mom, I can protect myself because I just- Enough! Oh, now I'm the bad guy. You didn't have to yell. I'm so sorry, Riley. I've just been so stressed out trying to keep you safe. I really need that massage. Do you feel better now? Yes, thank you. You always make me feel better, dear. Now, do you promise you won't try and go outside? I promise. I, I don't know what I was thinking. That's a good girl. 